a girl, a girl's blog about um. Uh, I I think she was just starting with her blog, I guess, uh, starting uh, February this year, and I, and I was looking through it, and she ha she had reviewed um the Nine Small Concert, the Morning Miss Man Nine Small Concert, and also the Shuffle Date, the Shuffle Date um, concert, and um <laughs> and she was really vocal, <laughs> meaning uh, meaning that uh. She was using a lot of vulgar languages. <laughs> if you if you don't dig if you don't dig like uh, her harsh opinion about it, eh, like I don't mind I don't mind actually I don't mind that I actually find that really funny. It's like saying like um, during the Nine Small concert, um, uh, Takahashi Eye looks like a drowned cat because she's like all sweating all over it and stuff. <laughs> so anyway, um, you you should check it out. Uh, I'll put it on the um, description. Uh, the site, the site is called um, www.nekohimenaoko.com, and and the blog's name is called um, "Life Is One Time." <laughs> yeah, check it out. But but you know, just to warn you, this has really really coarse language in it. <laughs> okay, um, and that is all for the news. Uh, new releases. There's only one there's on there's only one new release for this for this for this week coming and it's on and it's released today which is um Maeda Yuki's um new single called Miya Neo Gomenasai. I'm I'm totally estranged of uh Maeda Yuki's work or any of her single. I haven't actually I haven't actually heard her sing at all like or any of her singles but if you're a fan of Maeda Yuki, good for you, cause um, it's gonna be, it's really released today in Japan, um, the seventh of April, and you should get on buying it. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, that that is all. There's really nothing uh, interesting to talk about to talk about this um, upcoming week, and no new releases at all. Ne ne next week is kind of promising, so I'll just mention it on episode ten of um, Hello Dude. And speaking of episode ten of Hello Dude, since next week I'm my podcast has finally reached double digits, the big one o. Um, I'm I'm uh like I said at the end of um the uh, previous episode, if you have any like uh, email questions or something like that, so that I can read out on the show, and and I'll <laughs> and I'll and I'll answer it during the show too. So. So feel feel free to email, feel feel free to email like any type of um, Hello Project related question or about me or, or 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 stuff like that. But I'm gonna choose, and and you have and you have to know that um, I you have to know that I'm gonna read it out during the show, um, and, and say if you want if you want your question to be read out in the show. Um, I haven't I haven't got any emails from last week yet, so. Uh, or, or, or so, so, so try to be the first one who actually um, send in. You, you might be, <laughs> you might be recognized in the future as like the very first um, email that I actually um gonna read out. So any question at all, um, just uh, um questions like um who's your favorite member or why did you pick your favorite member or what's your favorite PV, what's your least favorite Morning Miss Man album, who's your least favorite Hello Project member. I kind of, I actually, I actually kind of like sort out all my favorites from last week. Um, since last week, I did like the the Hello Blog ranking poll thing, uh, 2010 poll, and I already um, explained through that. So, um, so anything, any any questions at all about the show or 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 stuff like that. So anyway, you can um, send your um, questions at hello dash dude at hotmail dot com. So that's hello dude hello dash dude at hotmail dot com. Any question at all, and I'll read it out next week. But if I didn't get any emails next week, eh, tough for me. <laughs> okay, that is all for the news for this week. Okay, now let's move on to the main feature of the show, which is the <laughs> hello hello um quick review. Um, and when I meant hello hello, meaning like all the major hello hello videos that's released by um the upfront agency featuring the hello project 
Kids, which is Kuto and Barry's Kobo, and also the um, main group, Morning Musume. Uh, <laughs> for this week, for this past week, I was really having trouble trying to find um, good content to talk about. Any like any new content to talk about? I was planning to uh, review um, Kago Ai's uh, new uh, new jazz album, but eh, it wasn't actually anything worth um, reviewing. Um, yeah, because with Kago, with Kago Ai's album, uh, she just did like her own rend- kind of her own rendition and some of the classic songs, some some um, Ella Fitz- Ella, some from uh, Ella Fitzgerald, a bit of from Frank Sinatra and and stuff. She she kind of like changed the um, she she kind of arranged it a bit and she kind of sang. She kind of sang okay, like. If I didn't know um, Hello Project or Morning Miss Man or Kago Ai at all, I, I, I could I, I could hazard a guess that um, she was uh, she was she was like Asian and Japanese and her pronunciation wasn't terrible, but it was kind of hard it was kind of hard to um, make out some of the words since 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 she since she um tried to like stretch she doesn't emphasize trying to pronounce the word right during the song it's kind of hard but uh, it was kind of okay album oh weird i already reviewed her album now <laughs> okay yeah I, I i give it a thumbs up it's kind of a good um chill out um album so if you're into like um jazz and stuff so anyway back to hello hello um i'm doing this uh, quick review of hello hello because since the announcement of um, morning misame releasing uh their fourth hello hello um dvd um, uh, I think during May, I think. <laughs> so anyway, um, I was kind of uh during my um time of uh learning Hell Project and Morning Musume, and and what <laughs> and and trying to like remember uh, uh their the members' names and their to their faces and stuff. And hello, hello, was hello, hello, um series was actually um the most that the most the, the most helpful visual one of the most he- helpful visual aid to um actually remember some of the members and it's actually more and it's actually really enjoyable to watch too along with the uh, with the mecha mecha ike um specials um the idea from hello hello is actually um just having the upfront agency um Gave a plane ticket to Morning Musume and Berries and Kyuto and just send them, send them back to Hawaii to to make a hour to make an hour long video, and and also uh, and also uh, make a couple of like a couple of photo books um by them by themselves or with the entire group as well, um, which is kind of like a bit tiring. To, uh, actually, I actually think that that the Hell Project members are kind of tired to keep going to Hawaii over and over again, but but that but they actually seem to enjoy themselves. Anyway, the very first I don't know I may, maybe I'm missing a couple of Hello Hello videos, but I'm just only focusing the main ones, which is the the first Hello Hello, uh, the first Hello Hello, the kinda Hello Hello. The second hello hello and the third hello hello and the berries hello 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 and the Kyoto hello hello. <sighs> uh yeah, videos. Um and I, I and I've got them and I got them all and I've watched some of them once. <laughs> uh well, well let's start well, let's start with the f- um the first hello hello. I think the first very first hello hello was um uh it, it was the Sakura Gumi versus Otome Gumi. You, you can correct me. You can send me an email if I'm wrong, but I reckon that, that that's the very first Hello Hello, and I didn't like that Hello Hello. <laughs> you know why? Because the entire show was really scripted, and I actually kind of felt silly. <laughs> it, it's kind it's kind of like watching the um um watching the Hello Morning um uh like like you know in the show um Hello Morning. Which they have like a little um, skit skit place that they um uh, that they do in part of the show, and I like those. But applying that during their um, 
during their stay in Hawaii is kind of like 